Howdy folks, it's time for some sports card talk. The 2022 World Series is here and I want to celebrate by showing off uh, two early vintage uh, Dusty Baker cards. The first one I'd like to point out is the 1971 Topps Rookie card. Uh, it's a three player card that Dusty Baker shares with Tom Pachorek and Don Baylor. Um, these cards are usually found off-centered. Uh, very hard to find this card centered. Uh, the black border tends to lend to uh, chipping, so often you'll see these cards chipped. Um, it's a short print, high number card, so there were obviously fewer of them printed than the uh, rest of the set. Um, but uh, it, it's an interesting little card. It's not my favorite Dusty Baker card. And there's the back. I'm not a big fan of these cards with three players, multiple player rookie cards. So I'd actually rather have his uh, second year card, which is the uh, 1972 Tops. I don't have one right now, but I'll probably try to look for one in the uh, baseball offseason. So uh, I'm not going to really upgrade this one I have. It's a lower, lower grade example of the card, but... I've had it since I was a kid, so it's pretty neat that it survived this long. So I'll just uh, keep the one I got for right now. The second item I'd like to show off is this 1974 Venezuelan League sticker. Um, it comes from a set, obviously, from the, uh, Venezuela. It's uh, the set looks a lot like the uh, it's uh, like like the 1968 top set that's what they used as a basis of design and uh, the um, it's a sticker on the front and it's uh, black uh, it's blank on the back this one has two little pen marks on the back so that's why it got the uh, MK designation from PSA but I think this card really presents very well it's really hard to find these cards in uh, any kind of decent grade mainly because they were stickers, so kids would stick them in an album. There was an album that would come with it, and, you know, obviously, very few survived. So, uh, it's, it, it, this is kind of hard to find, this card, but, or a sticker, I should say. And I, I kind of like this card. It, it shows off Dusty as a nice, happy, smiling face here. He's kind of like enjoying the game of baseball and just, he's like, you know, just enjoying life. Where if you uh, kind of look at uh, Dusty in the 1971 card, he just looks way too serious. So, um, anyway, I think this is a very good example of this Venezuelan sticker card. These uh, are very low population card sticker I should say to be honest with you um, as far as I know there's only really been two Dusty Bakers graded by PSA and uh, none by SGC uh, so it's fairly rare but it's not a hugely expensive card um, you can get this at a very reasonable price if you can find it so it, it's an interesting little example like I said I'm very happy to have this one in my collection because I think it really does present very well it's nicely centered, and it's just it's just a good all-around example. Um, just a few words about Dusty Baker that I wanted to add. Uh, he's uh, managing the Houston Astros in the World Series right now. Uh, through the end of the uh, 2022 season, he's had over 2,000 victories as a manager. That puts him ninth on the all-time list for managers. Um, all eight of the managers who have more wins than him, they're in the Hall of Fame. The one problem with Dusty is he does not have a World Series title yet. All the other eight that are ahead of him have World Series titles. So, But I, honestly, I, I believe that Dusty belongs in the uh, uh, Hall of Fame. He, he's, he's got a really good resume. He's won three pennants. Uh, he possibly could win the current World Series. So... It, it, even if he doesn't, I really do think he belongs in the Hall of Fame. 2,000 wins as a manager is just an incredible uh, resume to put together. Finally, one quick uh, trivia item about Dusty Baker. A lot of people 
uh, tend to forget that he was on deck when Hank Aaron hit his uh, uh, home run number 715 to uh, break Babe Ruth's home run record. Uh, that was on April 8th, 1974. So as a result, he was one of the first people to uh, congratulate uh, Hammering Hank on his uh, accomplishment. Um, if you like the content, please click the like button, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for viewing my video. I hope the rest of you have a, have a great day. And remember, collect what you like, not what other people think you should collect. Bye-bye.